Hello. <rire> euh, on me dit si je suis ici. Bah. Yo, je dis, je suis ici. Je suis ici. On me dit si je suis ici. 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 Je Alright. Li Qi Zhao Yu. So, yeah, the Zhao implies it's a bad experience. Right? Zhao oh, Gao. Uh, no, it's not Zhao so Gao. It is Zhao Yu de Zhao. Uh, yeah, Zhao so Gao is also a bad thing and also pronounced Zhao, but it's not that Zhao. Yeah. Zhao uh, so Yu. Zhao so Shou. Oh, you. It's a negative thing. Uh, okay, dear, how pushing the shit, right? Negative thing. Tin shen ting ni de shi ting, do ji, uh, ku nan. Ku nan. Um, zai huo de. Yeah. It's a bad thing. You can't. Um, however, the English doesn't say that, right? Sports stars, strange experiences. Bit of alliteration going on there. In there. Uh, sports stars, strange experiences. Well, that's really hard to say. <laughs> All right. Roll calling. Yeah, it's all, I should show you now that I mention it. It's all gold. It's all It's not the same. It's all. It's all gold. This one. It's all gold. Yeah, different meaning, I guess. Or this it's all is a verb, and this one's an adjective, right? Uh, it's a lot of things, it seems. I've only ever seen it in Zogol, so, you know. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, there you go. It is adjective, but a bunch of other things, too. Okay. It looks like we're l looking at some random words. Um, uh, what? Ting Dui Jiao, Tu Pian, Shu Xi Xia Lian Ming Cheng, Bing Sang Sang Na Xia Kernung, Gay Rin Lei Dai Lai, Yi Wai Shang Hai. How would it harm um, people? Mao Tao Ying, Mao Tao Ying, like Harry Potter, and your Gu Shi, Xiao Shuli. Um, no, which money the Joe Sony Fung Tien, Nigger Tien, Kernung Mani, the Thai Harley Potter, you jolly. Um, how to ying a book way Shanghai then? Way ba, this you can share Shanghai need a chong, Rugo Neo Chong Lao Shu. You say, Malto ying Kay Turan Fee, a fago lie. Um, she lure lure go sweep sweep. Mm, okay, maybe this one fee pool fee pool. Hmm, what do you think? How would you express that? An owl swoops down and eats your pet mouse. <laughs> Mm, si -si, mm, maybe this one. Fu Chong. Dive bomb. Oh. <laughs> um, but let's, let's ask Touching Petit because I honestly don't know. How would you say. How would you say an owl swoops down and eats your pet mouse in Chinese? Don't use Lue. What do you use if it's not lue? Maybe you do use lue. Yeah, yeah this is what ChatGPT is like for me. One second. Is it my internet or is it the chat? No, um. I'll start it again. Uh, okay. Mao Tao Ying. Fu Chong. Okay, it is that one. Fu Chong. <laughs> Dai Bomb. Xia Lai. <laughs> okay, so that's 
how it could hurt a, uh, an owl could hurt a human. Um, aside from that, they just sleep at night. Uh, they sleep during the day, right? So you barely notice them. Um, what else? I don't know. That's all I can think of. Uh, Garfu. Gar Garfu. Oh, okay. Garfu. <laughs> Kind of <laughs> make a yeah, the poor angel. So don't you don't. Um, go fu. Yes, you da uh da go fu there in. Um, yes, you tamen the detail. Tamen the dinang but I how tamen bushao sin. Uh, he da jo uh, nigga chu go fu chu pong down it ho shan. Oh, oh, I don't know, something like that. Jing Shi Pai. Um, Jing Shi Pai. Jing Shi. Jing meaning alert, right? Shi meaning indication. Pai meaning sign. Jing Shi Pai. Victor danger signs. Uh, okay. <laughs> Can you read the one? This one with the ridiculously tiny. I cannot read that. Can you read it? It's too small. Ah, oh, it says warning. It says it on the screen. It's not how my, my phone can make it large enough for me to read. It just says warning. Okay. It's not within human. Well, real yan can. It does say warning. It's really tiny. <laughs> um, warning signs. How can a warning sign... How can a warning sign help hurt someone unexpectedly? Yes, you come in the... I don't think of anything else. Um... Jingshipaisha,或者也许在特殊的情况下,你应该走进什么地方。但是呢,牌子说不许进,不许进入,对吗?所以你不进入,啪啪啪啪啪。Okay,下一个。运一板,运 is a verb to meaning to iron. 熨衣服。你在熨衣板上熨衣服. Yeah, I have, I don't think ever in my life. I've, I mean, I've ironed things, but I don't know. I would just not buy clothes that need ironing. Why, who, why would you waste time doing that? <laughs> I don't know. It's like a totally unnecessary thing in your life. You just buy clothes that don't need ironing, and then you're done. Yun Yeah. Um okay, so yun yi ban ni ba ta jo die qi lai de shi hou ke nang um jia shou, de ma jia shou. No yu yan tong. Ju shi yi wai de na. Ru guo ni jia zhuang e yun yi ban shi is that right? Hua Lang Ban. Hua Lang. No. Um. <laughs> How do you say pretend an iron in board is a surf board? It's not Hua Lang, no? Then what is it? Chong Lang. Oh, yeah, Chong Lang Ban. Yeah, it's Chong Lang Ban. Sorry, I had to think about that. Chong Lang Ban. Chong Lang Ban. Nani Jia Zhuang, ni de yun yi ban shi Chong Lang Ban. Bu xiao xin jiu diao la. Jiu shi shai dao, diao zai di shang. All right, my internet's... Yeah. This is what it's like here. Patience. There we go. Chong Lang Ban. Yeah, surfboard. Chong Lang Ban. 
Pretend your ironing board is a surfboard and hurt yourself. <laughs> Wang Pai. Wang Pai is a yellow card. Um, there, your Hong Pai. Uh, Hong Pai or Wang Pai. Uh, yes, you. Wang Pai will um, ruin your life. 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 呃，踢足球等等。嗯，除此以外，想不到别的原因。嗯，电钻。嗯，钻 meaning to drill. 电钻 meaning an electric drill. 电钻。嗯 ，you probably know 钻 from、uh, such words as 钻石 right? 嗯、um, ，need to be careful of the tone here. 钻石。电钻 ，fourth tone, fourth tone. Okay, the verb. Oh, <laughs> 电，电钻 ，fourth tone, fourth tone. Um. Okay, so the verb 钻呃钻，钻石。呃 ，Okay. Uh, let's pick one. 钻钻石 ，what a show. <laughs> blah blah blah. 钻石洞 ，like drilling a hole. 钻石洞 ，no， 钻石洞，钻石洞。Okay， so the 钻 first tone is the verb. Yeah， there's quite a few like this. Um， do you know the word uh 钉 ？This one. <laughs> um， so which one's the verb？ 钉，钉子。Fourth tone here is the verb。钉，钉子。Um， there's other ones like that. I can't think of any off the top of my head. There's a, there's many others, um, and you change the tone and it changes the part of speech, right? So, um, ding fourth tone is a verb, whereas ding first tone is um, um, it's a noun, and the other one, oh yeah, gold, gold. So, uh, no, no, both a uh, both a first tone here, right? Gold, gold. If you hang up a hook, <laughs> hmm. There's other ones. I don't remember something. Dian Zuan. There's all sorts of ways to get hurt with a Dian Zuan. Um. Yes, you. In 不小心，嗯，用电钻钻进你的钻破，你的皮肤钻破。哇啊！我受伤了。All right. Don't do that. Entering the. <laughs> All right, these ones. Pai. Pai can mean a few things, but it usually is like sign or brand or something like that. Um. Okay. Jiang Pai, Jin Pai, Yin Pai, Tong Pai, Chuo Pai, Men Pai, Hao Pai, Lu Pai, Uh, Jing Shi Pai, which we just saw, Huang Pai, Um, Deng Ji Pai, Deng Ji Pai, Pai Zi. All right, yeah, the, we should maybe paizi. We'll look at paizi. Paizi is just a generic sign. Paizi. Um, paizi. Let's start with this one. Paizi. <laughs> um, yeah, they're all different signs. You probably know the word pinpai. Uh, you know this one? Pinpai? <laughs> Logo? I don't know. If you don't know it, you now know it. Brand mark, brand, uh, trademark or brand name, pin pay, or shang biao, shang biao is trademark, but this doesn't have pay, pin pay. Um, you probably know ming, uh, ming pay, ming pay. I don't know ming pay, <laughs> famous brand ming pay. Ah.、Oh. Oh, I didn't know it also means name tag, but that makes sense, right? Mean. Oh, okay. I accidentally stumbled upon something I didn't realize. <laughs> An oran. <laughs> All right. So, so mean pay can also mean your like a name tag, right? Mean is means. Pay is like sign, right? Pay. <laughs> okay, I did not know that. Is it my mean pay? My famous name tag. <laughs> All right, that's really interesting. 
All right. So, um, Jiang Pai. Another question for Jiang Pai is Jiang means um, prize. Pai meaning sign. So I'm expecting some kind of, I don't know, trophy or something like that. Jiang Pai. A plaque. Oh, a medal. Jiang Pai. Okay. So, who is Jiang Pai? Ah, oh, this is Xunjiang. Yeah, this is kind of different, isn't it? It's still the same but different. Yeah, I have to think of military things when I think of Xunjiang. Okay, so Jiang Pai, Jiang Pai is medals. Um, yeah, so medals for competitions, presumably. Um, okay. So it's like Olympic Yeah. yeah, or Chang or am I? Oh, okay. Yeah, now you need to go to the house. I was like, I'm not going to go to the house. I'm not going to go to the house. I'm not going to go to the house. i uh, <笑>那个二零零零年奥运会获得了奖牌。No, <笑> 然后呢,又发现,哦,他获得了奖牌。我们可以搜索他。嗯。So <笑> I don't know how to spell it in English. <laughs> oh, that's why. It's not an English word. What's that? Tai Chuan Dao. That's a rare character, isn't it? Tai. Tai Chuan Dao. Tong Pai. So he got Tong Pai. Tai Chuan Dao. Carling Ling Nian. Xi Ni. He. Xiao Yun Hui. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. What have his fighter? French guy. <laughs> uh, no. Uh, ah, oh, there's different categories. So, Nanzi. What's Nanzi? Jigger. Ah, yo, Jishita. <laughs> yeah, orange ta. Oh, orange orange ta. Why do you think he's a gen? Uh, So he, he made sure to. He, 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 Tongpai, <笑> 
，耶，做教练，<笑>很有意思的，<笑>嗯 ，OK， 嗯 ，So， OK， these next three words， I think you know， 金牌，呃，金牌、银牌、铜牌。Although they're on the periodic table of the elements, right? Gold, silver, bronze. Uh, gold, silver, copper. <laughs> gold, silver, copper. Um, copper you can turn into bronze. Bronze is qing tong, right? But you say tong pai, meaning bronze medal. So, um, ta huo de le tong pai. Um, okay. So yeah, I'll just look at this photo, I guess. Oh, actually, there's a better one. This is the London Olympics. No, Tokyo Olympics. Yeah, your yin pai, your jin pai, your tong pai. Do han ni hai tu. Um, and yeah, so for bronze, you usually you say qing tong. It's this qing. I don't. Qing is a kind of color. Um, it's. It's this kind of, I guess, coppery color. <laughs> um, when copper oxidizes, the yang hua tong, yang hua tong, the yan se yang hua tong, this kind of yan se is red, uh, red, 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 red yan se. There you go. A yang hua tong oxidized copper. Um, ah, what's the Statue of Liberty in Chinese? Zhiyou Nu Shen. Oh, I like that name. Zhiyou Nu Shen. Okay, I've talked about him already. Zhiyou Nu Shen. Just this answer, right? Yang, Hua, Tong. Yeah, yeah, All right, so copper is tong, bronze is qing tong. Um, yeah, I don't know why, because bronze isn't really, it's not meant to oxidize, right? Yeah, <laughs> but it's called qing tong. Hmm, is there another word? Is there another word for bronze? No. Um, okay. Bro. Qing Tong Shi Dai. The Bronze Age. Qing Tong. Qing Tong Shi Dai. This is a ding, right? A ding. Da Ming Ding Ding the Ding. This ding. It's an interesting character. Da Ming Ding Ding. All right. So this is the Bronze Age. All right, what's next? So Jin Pai, Jin, Jin is the, like gold, right? And you probably know Jin Rong or Jin, <laughs> what else? Gold, I don't know, whatever you make with gold. Yin, Yin, you probably know from such words as Yin Hung. <laughs> uh, yin Hung, and I, I, I don't have any other words. Yin Hung is probably the most common, Yin Pai. Mm. Yeah, I can't think of any others. Yin Ye, Yin Ye, does that count? Tong, we talked about. Tua Pai, yeah, this is what you think of it. Like, this Pai is a plate, right? Or a sign that you stick on a car. Tua Pai. Yeah, recently. <clears throat> I'll tell you a funny story. I'll speak in Chinese. I speak too much in English, right? Um, Jungo de Chopai, uh, Doyo de Jesse Shung Fun de, um, uh, Tian Chung, um, Jing Ju Ju Dai Biao Beijing, 
，这代表这张，等等，嗯、呃、嗯、呃，不是这个，这是个月，呃，月月呵呵，那个月代表，嗯、呃，等等，这是广东对吗？呵呵啊，在广东啊，是在广州粤，呃，简称，简称，广东。啊，广州 is the city. Ah,、oh, it's confusing. <laughs> no, no. I've been here. Let's see. Guangzhou. Okay, Guangzhou is the city. For some reason, it has Zhou in its name. Why? This province. <laughs> so, and Guangdong is the province. What about Guizhou? Is Guizhou a province or city? No wonder I get confused. Guizhou. Guizhou province. So, Guizhou province, um, and Guangzhou city. Why? Please explain. <laughs> Uh, all right, all right. Um, what was I saying? I'm com I've gone completely off track. Oh yeah, yeah, we're talking about license plates. Um, chop hand. Okay. Um, yeah, 最近在这里，我住在威海。威海的天气现在特别好，而且我或者应该说，于是，于是来自嗯。呃，全中国的人都来到这里，涌现在这里。<笑>呃，在我窗窗外就是沙滩，<笑>他们在沙滩里，嗯、呃，就是享受嗯、呃、假期什么？也现在就是假期，今天是呃五月三日，算是假期对吗？嗯，呃，所以呢，我就是。拍他们的车牌，这就是把呃拍车牌照片，对吗？嗯，我想收呃收集他们每一个省份，库库就是上海，对吗？呃，济，我忘了河南，对吗？<笑>呃，津，陕陕西的啊，他生气。<笑>我是人，我是人，嗯、uh, ，OK， 你明白。我我不是机器人，哎呦，摩托车，摩托车，摩托，那这算是摩托车车呢？我不知道，<笑>不啊，我需要更仔细的看摩托车，呃、uh, ，OK， 红绿灯。红绿灯，我选择这些吧。这是红绿灯还是不是红绿灯？难以说，对吗？就是红绿灯的一部分。巴巴士，嗯，哦，选择这个吧。这是它的影子，不算对吗？不算在内。摩托车，哇 ，Crosswalks， 嗯，斑马。这什么？斑马？斑 ？What is it? 斑 ？Oh, I forgot. I I could look it up on Google. Can I Google? It? <laughs> uh, what do you? It's called crosswalk. Crosswalk in American, isn't it? Crosswalk. 人行横道 Oh, you don't say um zebra crossing. 斑马线。斑马线。人行横道。人行横道。Hmm. What do Australians say? We just say the crossing. <laughs> I think the crossing or the pedestrian crossing. Um, cross is that a crosswalk? I don't know. What's the definition of a crosswalk? It doesn't seem to cross anything. So I'm going to say that's not a crosswalk. Like a, well, which one? That looks like a crosswalk. It's this is it's this American word. <laughs> Don't have this concept. Oh come on! These are American buses. That's it. 
That's a bus. These are school buses. We don't have buses like this in Australia. You kind of have those buses in China, but most people just walk to school. Um, oh! Uh, Taiwan, Chopai. Okay, I answered. <laughs> 就是越南我就是安错了什么 呃，绿色的、蓝色的车牌。嗯，为什么有两个蓝、呃，两个颜色的车牌呢？因为呃，那个绿色的就呃，代表这个电动车，呃，电动车的车牌，呃，就是绿色的。我不喜欢我，对不
Chop, uh, not that chop. <laughs> That's chop, yeah, the chop. Chop, hey. Chop, hey. Okay. So, table plate. Uh, Liao Bai. Okay, yeah. I'm not so familiar with that, okay. Um, alright. What's next? I don't, we how pie. Oh, I wanna sorry, I'm flicking all over the place. Um how pie. I don't know, I don't think it exclusively refers to cars. Alright, it looks like I'm not gonna be chat GBT today. Oops. Sorry, that's my um that's my writing from this morning. <laughs> I accidentally flicked up. Um mm. Let's just look on Plicko. Oh, okay. Hmm, show me in Biao Yo Hao Ma de Pai Zi Number Plate. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, Hao Pai. I guess in English, number plate usually refers to a, a, a car, li, car's license plate. Hmm. Jing Shi Pai, we already saw this sort of thing. Jing Shi Pai. Huang Pai, yeah, um, we already saw that too, actually. Huang Pai and Hong Pai. Used in football. Deng Ji Pai, yeah. So Deng Ji means to board. Okay, Deng means to board. Ji means plane, right? Bei Ji. <laughs> Deng Ji, to board a plane. Pai. The like sign or in this case card, so boarding pass. Dong ji pai, you need a dong ji pai to dong ji. What I uh, what is dong ji call? Who is dong ji pai? Dong ji, my plane. Blah blah blah. Yeah. All right. So they're all some sort of flat physical object. Um. Yeah. They. They all seem to represent some sort of information, right? So this represents uh, some kind of penalty. These represent danger. Um, and other ones like chopais, like serial numbers and so on. So they all give some sort of information. Um, I guess the prize, the medal and the various medals are kind of information on who won what, et cetera, et cetera. All right, next is, um, fin, do my, <laughs> fin. I get fin and bay mixed up. Still, after all these years, I still get fin and bay mixed up. Do you get them mixed up? Oops, I didn't write that very well. I'll do it again. I don't know, do you, I find them hard. Fin. You're not given any hints, right? Um, this is bay, and this is fin. Um, there's no real hints in the character, no, like, or... Uh, why would this be pronounced fin and this be pronounced bay? I, I don't know. <laughs> um, let's just check. It's chun, chun bay de bay. Chun bay de bay, yeah. And xing fin de... <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I always get those mixed up. <laughs> Very easy to mix up. <laughs> All right, what have we got here for fin? Um, what does fin actually mean by itself? Maybe if I know that, I will know. I don't know. Three meanings, all verbs. Okay, what do we got here? Niao. <laughs> Oh, really? Um, so this is, looks like a chung to me. Okay, spread the wings. Oh, okay. Um, what is it? Why is it ji? Ji bing de ji. I don't know. Weird. 
Um, they, they saw. Oh, okay. Maybe I should use that in the future instead of like be young. <laughs> no, I have to think about. It. Okay. So I haven't encountered this meaning before, so I'm not going to prioritize that. Ah, your students. Uh, okay. Junzo gu gu jin. Junzo gu jin. So this is like energetically or something like that, right? Exert oneself. Gu jin. Encourage, rouse enthusiasm. Okay. Fen bu shen. Fen bu shen. This is unable to arouse oneself. Uh, around, not in the, um, ah, oh. fen bu gu shen. Oh, no. It's not fen bu gu. It is fen bu gu shen. <laughs> right? Um, okay, so it's fen. It's like d dashing ahead. Gu gu, not caring about shen. So shen in shen ti can also pertain to your health. So you're not caring about the health and your danger, uh, what dangers may affect your physical health. You're just dashing ahead. I guess that's the logic. Okay. Um, I think I have studied this. Spare no effort. Don't know this one. Stir oneself up. Okay. And the third meaning. Um, duty. Gui dong, duty, to lift up. This is like physically lift up something, probably something heavy. What is hui dong? Brandish. Oh yeah, I've encountered that. <laughs> um, okay, fen bi ji shu. It's a ji it's a again. Fen bi ji shu. To write at tremendous speed. Okay, so this ji here probably just means like very fast. <laughs> Um, it's probably like a intensifier, like uh, It doesn't literally mean I was scared to death, right? This uh, <laughs> okay. Fenbi uh, I don't know what that means. Fenbi fen to raise up. Ah, be your arms go. I guess go da sheng is probably da sheng and hu is uh first time hu hu huan maybe hu huan so raise your arms up and shout yay wo yi la wo tong go la kao shi la wo zai wo wei lai de wo wei zhe yang shuo Hmm. Hmm. Oh, oh, okay. we'll go. Now let's look at the list. Okay, Finny, strive. And uh, I've listed verb and adverb. Hmm, this might take a while. <laughs> yeah, Finny. Ah, another word, Findo, Findo, Finfa, Findin, Finti, Finyong, Finjan, Fa Fin, Sing Fin, Tin Fin. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Undaunted by dangers. All right. Yeah, let's look it up. Let's look it up properly. It's here. So it's putting a large amount of physical effort. Something like that. Oh, Ah, oh, it's putting in all effort. <laughs> okay, so putting all one's effort into struggling against something, I guess. So doing, uh, putting in your effort, uh, in all, putting in all your strength into rescuing the wounded. Um, yeah, again, it's another word for struggle. Yeah, okay, so lo shui meaning fall in the water. Um, it's not, it kind of implies drowning, I guess. Uh, anyway. So doing everything in your power to striving 
to rescue a child who has fallen in the water, or children, <laughs> depending on the context. Why have I put adverb there? Let's have a look at your doll. Your doll, wait, also are. Oh, this one. Uh, Maybe that's used in a more narrow context. Ta jin la ju ta bu fang. No. Ta jie jin. Ta jin la ju ta bu fang. Ta fen li zheng tuo. So he grabbed her with and didn't release. Um, he, with all her might, struggled. Ta shun li tong go kao shi. So she passed the test with ease, shunni meaning smooth or easily, <laughs> right? Um, like struggled. Right? So this is like strive, what is it? Spare no effort. It emphasizes you're doing everything possible, putting all your effort into this. Um, this physical effort, I think. Exert oneself. Um, 营救, 营救, what is 营救? 营救 is yet another word meaning rescue. 营救大火中的受害者,受害者,受。Receive, hi, harm, jaw, person, I guess. The, mm, it's not really a person, it's, uh, in this context, it's going to be a person. But it is the entities which have this property. <laughs> they have received harm. In this case, yeah, it will be people. Hmm. All right. Um, you can see I, I colored a ball in almost all of them in last time, so it seems this character is a bit um, weak for me. Um, yeah, I kind of expected that. So I guess this is a verb. Um, so does it take an object? What is Work energetically for prosperity. <laughs> um, all right. Na Jiang uh Jidi uh, so again, work energetically for, so it's a specific usage. There's a mistake here. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I, I hear speeches and things like that, and it's just like, here are four characters, here are four more characters, here are four more characters. And it doesn't mean anything to me when people speak like that. It's very hard to get a grasp on the structure. Yeah, here it is again. What about this one? Uh, it's not fun fa, it's fa fun. <laughs> is fa fun and fun fa the same thing? I think it is the same thing. Oh, fun fa seems to be like arouse someone else. Fun fa nu li. Not necessarily. We aroused our hard work. 
奋发，奋发，嗯，奋发人生的目标。呃，电脑不来，奋发有为。Uh, uh, uh, I don't know what do these mean. 于奋发中明白，奋发进取的人，人格力。No, 人格力量。奋发进取的人格力量，人格力量。So is that like a collocation? 进取。This becomes an It's becoming an adjective or an attributive. Ah, <laughs>、uh, 在中国正在奋发图强，图强。I don't know. Let's ask. Is ChatGPT going to reply? Can you help? Can you help me understand? 奋发 It's not even in my input. Please. Maybe it's not that important. Maybe it's important that I know fun has this kind of arouse meaning, and fun fa fa fun this sort of thing utilizes that. Not having much luck with ChatGPT today. It's is it my Wi-Fi? I don't know. It could be a hundred different things. Come on, come on! Yes. 奋发呃，指的是鼓动和激励。No, 鼓励和激励。呃，积极去努力奋斗。奋斗通常是在面对挑战和困难时，用来激励自己的自己积极进取的精神状态。这个词常常用来。描述一个人在面对困难时不畏艰辛，所以不畏 meaning not not shrink away from, <laughs> right? Unafraid, 艰辛 hardships, 积极向前，全力以赴的去解决问题或实现目标的精神状态。Can you give me five examples? Oops. Come on, tell me you're there. Come on. 面对生活中的挑战，他时刻保持着奋发向上的精神，从不气馁。Okay, so 学课 so this 学课 usually 学课 means、um, uh, like an instant, an instantaneous moment.、Um, so I think this 学课 here does not mean that, though. Judging from the context, I think that 学课 means at at any moment or.、Um, Continuously, constantly, or always. <laughs> so it's kind of it. It means an instantaneous moment, and also always. It means a and not a. <laughs> x and not x. He was young when he set out on his ambitious goal. After many years of hard work. 终于成为了一名成功的商业领袖。All right, so blah blah blah. This one, 奋发图强 work energetically for prosperity. I guess 图 so 图 can mean、um, like attempt, like 试图的图 Here meaning 意图 maybe、um, intention at seek. 强 ，so seek seek power, seek strength, something like that. All right. 呃，这个团队的每个成员都充满了奋发的斗志。斗志 is like morale or um 
fighting spirit. Okay, let's do that. Uh, 他们一起努力，共同完成了这项艰巨的任务。All right, so they've um an energetic fighting spirit used as an adjective here, used as part of this this chung you here. <laughs> Um, the chung is used as a an adjective, and here again it's used as uh, kind of a a phrase, part of a phrase which is used as an adjective, hmm. or maybe more precisely an attributive. 在学习中遇到困难时，他们应该保持奋发向上的态度，呃，勇敢的面对挑战。So this is the kind of same thing as the first one, right? But instead of jingshen, they used title. I told you I get them mixed up. Here, jubei. It's not jufen. It's jubei. Jubei fenfa. I think ChatGPT is like a mind reader at times. Just here you go. Get those confused. Alright, so here we're talking about a uh, um uh fenfa jingshen. It's kind of becoming a compound word here, uh, or a com a multi phrase adjective to describe this. Um, here, li is being used as a verb. Li yu, so establishing, establishing, wu bai zhi di. Um, so, wu meaning not, bai meaning shu shu bai, <laughs> unable to fail. Zhi di, like a kind of, um, I don't know, a base or a footing. Uh, uh, sorry, I've spilled my coffee. <laughs> I'm gonna pause for a second. All right, all right, don't panic. <laughs> um, yeah, it wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad. Um, I did, yeah, I spilled my coffee and it's got a little bit of mess here now, but it, it could have been much worse. Um, yeah, if my landlord is watching, yeah, it's, it's not on the bed. <laughs> it just went on the floor. And the floor's tiled, so it, it barely mattered. Yeah. Anyway, I kind of like all these little stains and things because it shows <laughs> kind of accumulate them over time. Uh, it kind of shows that you've um, actually used them. Um, but I'm glad I didn't spill it all over this one. I remember, yeah, in this one, in this, in the Shangzhe, I spilled my logama. <laughs> logama, it's a, it's in one of the texts. Which one? I forget which which one it is. But I got logama. <laughs> uh, on one of the texts, I forget. Fine. And every time I read it, it's like, oh, that's the time I spelled logama on my textbook. <laughs> oh, there it is. What <laughs> logama the woods? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, I, I was just, I had my textbook there and look at my, oh. <laughs> oh. All right. Anyway, uh, where were we? Um, chapter 23? Chapter 23 or chapter 24? Uh, chapter 24. Sorry. <laughs> uh, now, where were we? <laughs> uh, okay, we've done with fun fa. Next is fun jin. So, what does the fun in fun jin mean? Uh, so I kind of I've jotted down advanced bravely. Oh, sorry, I should do this. 
Let's look at some of Advance bravely, okay. Jin. So Jin meaning to advance. Qin Jin de Jin. Um, Ben. All right, so it's so it's like not afraid of adversity. Pubian Rimway. Chong Gong, Tsuiren, Ben Jin. Success encourages people um, to strive. People are motivated by success. Is that like a saying in general? Maybe. Okay, so So you often see how used as a suffix like this on like a plane or a boat or whatever, spaceship. Um, yeah, you probably know Chang or for example. Um, so this Chang'e is the name of a spaceship. Um, lunar spacecraft. Siha is number four. So Chang'e of four. And the ha uh, indicates it's some kind of vessel. Um, like vessel in the sense of going for another uh, celestial body. <laughs> um, all right. Benjin. Ben Jin Ha is the name of the endeavor. Okay, Ben Jin Ha. I did not know that. Ben Jin Ha. Ben Jin Ha. So, space shuttle endeavor. Okay, Ben Jin Ha. So, it's not the endeavor, the ship. Um, the. How do you spell it? Endeavor. Um, yeah, the endeavor, um, it is the endeavor, right? HMS endeavor? Let's, let's search for that. So what did they call it? Nu li ha. Nu li ha. What is that? San Wei. Okay. That makes sense, right? Wei. Okay, so the, you have the, the wood on the left. And the pronunciation on the right, right? Wood relates to masts. And the pronu uh, pronunciation is way instead of way, way, send away. Similar pronunciation. Sam way, fantron. Okay, so this is the endeavor. <laughs> um, and fenjin, uh, fenjin ha is this. Uh, it's grumpy at me, doesn't it? Ben Jin Ha was um, the spaceship, the space shuttle endeavor. Nu Li Ha was the HMS endeavor. Okay. All right. All right. Anyway. Ben Jin. Um, all right. They get, get, these websites always get grumpy at me. Um, but it's not. It's not really getting grumpy at me. It's getting grumpy at a whole bunch of roundabout ways of getting to their sites and so on. Um, so they start going, hmm, suspicious activity. Hmm. Ben Jin. Sorry, Ben Sorry, I'm just... just oh, anyway. So it seems Tweren Fen Jin encourage people so on to uh, progress bravely seems to be a co-location. So let's jot that down. Tui Ren Fen Jin. Fen. Big field. Jin. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Why is it big field? <laughs> big field. I don't know. I don't know why it's called that, but that's how you can remember it if you want to handwrite it. All right. Yeah. Um, was there anything? What's the definition? Okay, so fen can represent, can be replaced by the two character fen yong. All right. Fen yong qian jin. So is that on the list? Fen yong, here it is. 
All right, next is fen qi. So presumably qi is a verb and fen is modifying the verb. Um, right, so qi meaning to rise, but fen qi, to bravely rise up against injustice, I guess, or something like that. Fen qi. Fen qi, to rise vigorously, a started... Right. So you're rising up against the challenges, the, um, I don't know, these ginormous challenges, enhanced responsibilities is not challenging, but all right. Um, okay, Nongmin, saying peasants. Nu, oh, nu yi, nu yi. Okay, I don't know this word. I know the word nu li. So nu li. Nu li, meaning slave. So nu yi. Uh, there's also, uh, is it nu zhu? No. Li zhu, something like that. Slave owner? Ugh. It's that dictionary. <laughs> slave owner. Oh, just a nu li zhu. Um, and there's a, a slavery. Nu li zhu. Okay, so we're looking at nu yi. Nu yi. Nu yi. Okay, nu yi, ni men. So that's to turn you into a slave, to enslave you. All right, it's a verb. Nu yi, to enslave. Nu yi. I don't know. I did not know that word. Um, yeah. Do you know the Chinese national anthem, the first line? <laughs> Uh, what is it? Chilai Bo Yuan Zo. Maybe that's all. Nu Li. The Yuan Men. Is it that? Maybe it's the other Zo. <laughs> I don't know. Something. Like, yeah, I'll Google it. No, it's that Zo. Bo Yuan Zo. Nu Li the Yuan Men. <laughs> right? So it's people who are unwilling to be slaves. Yeah, <laughs> arise people who are unwilling to be slaves. <laughs> that's that's where you encounter nu li, or at least uh, in China, you uh, you encounter the word nu li usually in that uh, in the Chinese national anthem. All right, mm -hmm. uh, what's next? Sorry. Uh, oh, we're still looking at fen qi. Fen qi. So we're rising up against being turned into slaves. Fen qi. Fen qi. Uh, okay, 孩子们很高兴. 周围的人, oh no, that's different. This is 兴奋起来了. No, 兴奋. So this is, this is one of these examples where 兴奋 is an adjective, but it's being used as a verb. Um, yeah. Yeah, I discussed this with my friends and if English has the equivalent. And some of my friends came up with examples of adjectives that function as verbs. Uh, there was two particularly good ones I like. Brown the onions. Yeah, brown the onions. So brown is usually a color, right? It's an adjective. Oh, my, uh, I don't know, my blanket is brown or something like that. But if you brown the onions, it means to take the onions and make them brown. <laughs> I just realized I just used uh, bar to do in English, but anyway. Um, and the other one is wet the floor. You wet the floor. Actually, I wet the floor not that long ago, actually. Um, yeah, if you wet the floor, the floor is wet. It causes the floor to become wet. So the floor is wet, it's an adjective, but if you wet the floor, it kind of is a verb, kind of a verbdictive. Um, stop Stop using that word. It's not going to happen. I'm, I'm trying to make verbjective happen. Verbjective. If you can have an adverb, you can have a verbjective. That's my logic. All right. So going back, um, 
Here, yeah, this is one of these issues with these sites. They don't realize that xing uh, fen is the um, is the word here, and qi lai is a word here, but fen qi is not being used as a word here. Xing fen usually is an, uh, an adjective, but it's being used as a verb. You add the qi lai afterwards, so it's like increasingly adjective, in this case, excited. All right, so we need to watch out for xing fen qi lai, xing fen qi lai. Ah, jin fen qi lai. Are we going to study that word? No, we're not. Shall we add it to the list? Jin fen. Jin. It's like aroused or something. Uh, stirred up, inspired. Jin fen qi lai. Ren min fen qi kang. No, fen qi fan kang. Yeah, this is what I imagine. Rising up and overthrowing a tyrannical government or something like this. Uh, 这边, 边几边, uh, 全都, yeah, there's two words, there's 全部 and there's 全都, <laughs> and they look so similar. 全都, 全部, oh, so easy to get them mixed up. <laughs> 全都, in Juban uh. So we're trying to look at Fen Qi. But this is the best example we've gotten so far. Fen Qi. Fen Qi Ju Fen Qi What about no Jen Fen Jen Fen Xin Fen Xin Fen this one. Bali Remin Fen Qi Fan Kang Lu Yi uh Lu Lu Yi Fei Li uh okay this person <laughs> Fei Li Pu uh Pu uh Jun Jun Chu Li Xian Ji uh, all right that's a little uh, a little complicated for me but they rose up in revolt against this Fen Qi Fan Kang so that combination seems to be a good one. Um, uh, Fen Qi Chu Jui Chu rose up and pursued something. I don't know. Intellectuals. Woman Zai Tada Ling Dao Xia. Fen Qi Tai Chu Xing Dong. So he rose up and adopted action. <laughs> Took action. Uh, choose to rise up. Ah, oh, yeah, so rise up and resist the war. Um, so an unspecified civil war, but possibly China's. Uh, no, it's not, it's not one country, it's... Um, they're all countries. It's unclear which civil war this is referring to. Uh, uh, I don't remember this ever happening in history. Like, it's one civil war, but all the nations? Maybe it's after their respective civil wars or something. Hmm. Um, did it ever happen? <laughs> anyway, you the idea. So this is rise up and overthrow tyrannical dictators. Um, all right, what's next? Fenyong. So we saw that Fenyong was an adjective, right? Right? No. It, it is a kind of, maybe it's an adverb. Fenyong. Fenyong. Verb, adverb, verb, it's verby. Jin fen, ding shen, gu qi yong qi. So excite your, I don't know, nerves <laughs> and muster up the courage. Fen yong dang xian. What is dang xian? Dang to serve as xian, maybe as leader or something. Fen yong dang xian. To fight in the, ah, oh, it's, um, in Feng, is it? It's 
先锋 ，this one， 先锋 ，this one。What are we looking at again？ 呃，奋勇。嗯、uh, ，cancel。奋勇前进。Fair enough. I feel like that's an adverb. So the verb is 前进 right? 奋勇前进 The verb is 前进。呃，奋勇杀敌。Okay, 杀 meaning to kill, 敌 meaning enemies. So bravely kill the enemies. Um, I guess fight. Yeah, maybe more like attack or fight. Yeah. Uh, 自告奋勇 What is 自告奋勇 I don't know this one. Offer to undertake. 自告奋勇 Have I seen this before? So I see this. It's 自 meaning self. 告 meaning 告诉别人奋勇 <laughs> Mm -hmm. Bravery or something. So you're self-advertising your bravery, offer to undertake a dangerous task. This is the Fenyong. Tan, 参加突击队 What is a 突击队 Shock brigade. All right. All right. Fenyong. So it's kind of a verb slash adjective, or a verb that's used as an adjective. It's a verb that's used as an adverb. Sorry, that's my impression. Fenjian. So I guess this is a compound, um, separable verb, right? Fen, to strive, go for, bravely get involved in. Fen yong, da da jump, something like that. Fen jump. What's the definition? Fen ni, jump do, jump do. Fen ni, fen ni, jump do. Fight bravely. Ah, okay. 奋战七天 ，so the grammar is not that of a separable verb. It looks like. 经过四个月奋战，他们终于完成了试验。嗯嗯 ，so this here 奋战呃、uh, does not involve war, right? It's like some kind of struggle. Hmm. You, she, you, she, 奋战 You to bathe in, she, blood. You, she, you, she, um, 奋奋战 Yeah, to bathe in blood, fight in battle. Um, fight a bloody battle. 奋战到底 fight it out to the end. Tough it out kind of thing. Uh, 经过三个月的艰苦奋战。大江终于呃截流成功。大江 is a river. 截流 I guess connected the flow of something. Uh, oh no, 截 meaning to segment. No, 截流 dam a river. Okay. 堵截水流堵截啊、oh, I can't look. <laughs> I'm doing the inception here. I'm looking up. I'm looking at this word. And in this word, for this word, I'm looking up this word, and for this word, I've looked up. I want to look up another word inside that word. <laughs> oh yeah, a, a plecoception. <laughs> uh, oh dear, plecoception. Tieliu. Hmm. Routier to block the water flow, intercept. Um. Okay. So Jan Fen. What does that say? Fight bravely, evoke, no, work hard. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Fa fen. Ah, there it is. Fa fen and fen fa. Fa fen. Um, I don't know. They seem to be the same word, but maybe different grammar or something. What's the difference between fa fen and fen fa? Fen, to make an effort to push for something to work hard. Fen fa, to rouse to vigorous action, energetic mood. This is like to excite, more like, and this is to make an effort. Maybe the fen, the different words in there. Do han yo nu li fen dou de yi si, 
但在使用上略有不同。All right， 八分，具体时间就是要努力，可能出啊出于内在的冲动。OK， 奋发。Um, can you give me several examples for what it means? Funfa, funfa, fa fun, funfa, fa fun. 突然产生了这个吧 ？What about this? 强调持续性的努力啊。Okay, so this is longer term. Um, 奋斗精神。So this is could be more、um, impulsive, whereas this is more long term. He 考试前突然发奋，开始每天刻苦复习。So this is like a spurt of major effort before the exam.、Um, like like 刻苦 What's the word? Assiduously, <laughs> hardworkingly. Revise. 面对挑战，呃，他意识到自己必须发奋，呃，争取更好的未来。嗯、hmm. ，All right. Push for something, maybe. Push for a better future. Strive for a better future. 被老板批评后，他决定。Um, 发奋工作，呃、uh, ，争取取得更好的业绩。So this is taking an object. 发奋工作 ，No, that's not an object. No, this is a an a verb used as an adverb to modify this verb. He decided to, I don't know, make an effort when working, <laughs> make an effort style working. Uh, okay. Uh, 奋发，这个团队成员呃、uh, 都在奋发的努力工作，以完成这个重要项目。Oh, I really can't tell the difference between 奋发 and 发奋。他从小就树立了奋发进取的目标。啊，一直以来，呃，都在呃。都在为之努力，为之努力。算了 ，I'm not sure about that. 嗯，尽管遇到了很多挑战，他仍然坚持奋发向前。So here, this is being used as a verb, like persevered with doing this. Okay, 不放弃对梦想的追求。嗯，哎 ，interesting. I don't know. I can't tell the difference. I get the feeling maybe I shouldn't try to skip the hair on this one. Sometimes not so critical. All right, where were we? Excited. Oh, okay. Wow, he's very excited. Adjective meaning to be excited. I think that's a very early,、um, very early on. You learn this one. Excited. Excited. Oh yeah, he's very excited. Yeah. All right, I think you know that it's a it's nothing else, right? Xinfen, an adjective, excited things. Ah,、oh, it can be used as a noun. Physiology excitation. Hmm. Okay. Uh, uh, usually with physiology, I would use sedi, sedi, to stimulate. Sedi. <laughs> hmm. Anyway, I get the feeling we're not talking about physiology all that often. 勤奋，嗯，勤奋 meaning industrious. 勤奋，勤奋，勤奋，二声，四声，勤奋，嗯，勤奋的意思，呃，怎么解释？勤奋 ，industrious, right? What does it say here? Hardworking, diligent. Yeah.、Um, 
yeah, there's, there seems to be a few words like this. So t the other one is um, Tintian, is it right? Let me see if I get it right. Tintian, sorry, the Tian is a fairly rare character. Here it is. Is it Tintian? Uh, can I put it here? Uh, oh dear. What if I put in Google? Come on, give me something. Uh, it is it is my site this time. All right, so let's put it in Pleco, see what comes up. Infant. Um. Yen. Setian. Tindian. Oh, hardworking. Oh, okay. So, Tindian. So the Jian is a Jie Jian. All right. So it's almost like a separate word. Um, Qin Lao. Qin Lao. All right. So Qin Fen. Let's go to Qin Fen. Xue Xi Gong Zuo. Nu Li. Yeah, Nu Li. Nu Li is easier to handwrite than Qin. <laughs> and Fen. Fen I get wrong because I write Bei. So... Better to write Nori. <laughs> All right. Um, and we saw this. Fen bu gu shen. Fen, like so excited, so brave, bursting forth. Bu gu shen, not caring about one's own bodily safety slash, um, I don't know, health. All right. Next is men. <laughs> Um, I'll show you something funny. I want to, uh, since we're talking about men, uh, one second. Yeah, so the other day when I went for a walk, uh, I saw this door. Um, I saw this door and it, it had, so you can see why I like it, right? It has men. This is the traditional character, men. <laughs> men meaning door. I just thought, oh, that's interesting. So I posted it to mildly interesting <laughs> because it's mildly interesting. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> I thought that was curious. Anyway, that's that. I just, um, men. Men meaning door. Um, it's used as a measure word. Yimen ke. Yimen, yimen yuyan. Um, what else? Men. Mm, there's yamen, right? Like your teeth, front teeth or something. Um, yamen, is it? Wait, really? Uh, no. Okay, ya chi. Oh, maybe it's men ya. Oh, this one, men ya. Um, I don't know. Door teeth. These are your door teeth. Menya. Front teeth. Or your door teeth. I like that one. Door teeth. Um, yeah, I'm not quite sure. <laughs> Men. Besides door, what else does it mean? Um, yeah, this is the door one, right? Shuomen. Car door. Huang daomen. Huang daomen. I got no idea. Oh, okay. Actually, no, that was quite obvious in hindsight. Fung, meaning prevent. Dao, meaning like pirate. <laughs> Men, meaning door. So a burglar proof door. A burglar hobbit proof door. A burglar hobbit. Um, Hui Mer. Uh, I don't know. I don't think we want to. Whoa, all right. <laughs> I'm not going through all those. You can do that on your spare time. It's Men meaning door. Men jiang. I don't know. Shou men yuan. Shou men goalkeeper. What is men jiang? Jiang. It's like a general or something. Oh, there is actually one I'm going to add here. Oh, uh, if I forget. Men yuan. Because this one you might get wrong. <laughs> yeah, you might think. Mendian. Oh, okay. Um, Mendian. Tamen made a shishama. Tamen made a shit moonma. Bullshit. Dior dian. Made a shit dior na. 
酒店不卖酒，门店不卖呃不卖门。Um, what are we looking? At? 门将。What is 门将 ？Goalkeeper. Oh, okay, there it is. So it just means goalkeeper. 主力。Okay, 主力门将。哎 ，goalkeeper. 嗯，门卫。Um, we usually refers to a person. Um, is it we shu or something like that? We a person who is guarding something, that kind of thing. Um, so this is men wei. Um, but we were after a person. This one, ren yuan. Hmm. Um, okay, dan fu. 保护防守任务的人员 ，so someone who is in charge of protecting, um, protecting and defending something. Oh wait, yeah, rear guard. Shu wei. All right, there's there's a few like this. So we're looking at 门卫 so presumably they're guarding a door. 门口的守卫人员 Okay, so it's a type of 守卫 right? 球门，球门 will be the like the football net, right? Let's let's look at some images. It's easier. 球门，球门。Yeah, you also say 进门，进门。呃，哦，哦 ，no, you say 进球。You do say 进门 ，but you say 进球，进球，进球啦！太漂亮了。All right. Ah, 柜门柜 is cabinet, right? Um, 柜子啊，柜子或橱柜或衣柜，柜门。Let's put in 衣柜门。So 柜门 It's like cabinet doors. So maybe there's 呃橱柜。橱柜 will be the kitchen cabinets, whereas you have 衣柜衣服的衣。Maybe I'll just put an e for it here. E gui, clothing, uh, I don't know, clothing cabinet. There's also shu gui, like where you stick your books, <laughs> like a cabinet for uh, books. Um, are there other types of gui? Um, I don't know. Called tao jiu gui. Is that a thing? Well, I just made it up, but it exists. Um, I mean, I made up the word, right? I just thought, oh, it'd be something that exists, like a wine rack, I guess. But why is it not jia? The other one is jia. I don't actually know the difference, really. Jia.、Uh, all right, so this is rack shaped, and this is cabinet shaped. But you also have all of those. You ah、uh, no, you have shu jia. Shu jia. Rack is that a rack? Yeah, maybe it's not exactly the same as English. 衣架，衣服的衣，衣架 ，clothes rack. Do you have 衣架 I'm not sure. Um, 衣架 Um, seems like it does exist. Kind of where you store things in a kitchen, maybe. <laughs> Maybe it's not. Maybe it is a. Kind of, it is kind of a jia, 电器架电器电器 electrical devices, I guess. 电器架 All right. Anyway, what were we talking about? <laughs> I tend to go off topic a bit, don't I? Oh, gui gui meaning cabinet. So we had shu gui, yi gui, chu gui. Um, and maybe there's a bunch of other ones I'm not so familiar with. And men just means the door of a cabinet. Sure, men. No, I don't know this one. Sure, sure means to shoot. Sure, chang to shoot a gun. Sure, men. Shoot a door. Is that like in football? Sure, men. Is that to make a a shot for goal? Yeah. All right. It's a football thing. Sure, men. So this is shuoman, and then 进球 
，热门进球，热门进球。And what happens if it doesn't go in? Um, um, after someone, someone shermans, other than Jinchou, what can happen? What might happen? What's the opposite of Jinchou? I don't know. Mei Jinchou. Jinchou Mei Jin. Um. All right. Sorry, it's it's my life. <laughs> That's what happens. Jinchou. Okay, Shoman to make a shot at goal in a football context. Shoman. Maybe. Me. Me. Jin. Ah. Yeah, this isn't gonna work either. Mei Jin. All right. Anyway, what's next? Shoman. Oh, we saw that one. Shou meaning to guard or protect. Feng Shou to Shou, right? Protect the door. Um, you know this. Actually, there's one more I'm gonna add. Do you know this phrase? Come in and and this one. Please. Pay a little bit of attention here because can is first tone. I'm not sure. It's can, can, men, and no, can, men, and can. Yeah, there is a first tone. Usually you think can to look, but there's also can to kind of look after, kind of. Um, yeah. We'll add that one. Did ChatGPT reply? Give it a moment. Might happen. Mm. Uh, okay. What's this? Would you to dive? Ah, oh, okay. Shoumen Yuan. Okay, so there it is. Goalkeeper Shoumen. We saw just saw a second ago. Shoumen Yuan, Changgong, Jiang Qiu, Pu Chu, um, Zhu Jie, uh, Zhu Jie Le Jin Qiu. So prevented the goal. Okay. Jin Chu. So it went wide. Okay. Shuoman Pian Li Le Chuoman. Ah, Chuoman's a goal. Okay. So Pian Li went wide. So to deviate, deviated from the goal. Wei Nang Ming Zhong Mu Biao. Ah, Ming Zhong Mu Biao. Ming Zhong Mu Biao. Interesting. This is really helpful. Di Zhong Men, Men Zhu He Heng Liang. So hit the upright or crossbar. Menju. In football context, this would be the upright. Um, and this would be the crossbar, right? Feng Liang. Shuoman de Qiu Di. Zhong le men, Qiu men de Zhu zi he Feng Liang. Dan mei o jin qiu. Bei feng shou dui yuan dang chu. Intercepted by the defense. Uh, does, is not threatening because it was uh, blocked. Uh, I don't have a tissue. All right, anyway. Uh, okay. I don't know what Jiao Chu is. Jiao Chu. Ah, ah, obviously, a corner kick. Jiao corner Chu. Well, I guess football, but here it means kick. Like jin, jin qiu. Jin qiu doesn't mean something is going in the ball. It means the ball is going in something. Jiao <laughs> qiu he qiu men qiu. What is qiu men qiu? Qiu. Ball. No, I don't, I don't know. Qiu men. Qiu men qiu. I got no idea. That's a, some football terminology. 如果射门的球被呃守门员挡出一线，一线对吗？一线挡出底线，呃，当 no 通常会导致角球和球门球。I I don't know. Is it penalty? Is it a penalty kick or something? 球门球。
Ah, no, it's a, it's a, you know, when the goalie has a kick, <laughs> this, this sort of thing, there's no danger. The goalie got it, and then the goalie can kick it away. Um, what do you call it? A goal kick, is it? What do they call it? Chumenchou. Goal mouth. Is that really a phrase? Um, okay. Chu ji chi ta chu yuan chu ji. What is this? It is just touch. Touch another player. Is this like interference or something? Shoman uh, arbitrary kick, re kick. I like arbitrary kick <laughs> or arbitrary ball. All right, it's free kick. Arbitrary ball is free kick. All right. Showman, we saw yoman. Ah, yeah, yoman. Accelerator in a car. Yo, meaning well, it, it means oil, but in this case, it kind of pertains to gasoline. Um, although gasoline is gasoline a gas? I don't know. <laughs> um, petrol. Hmm. Mendian. Mendian is not a store that sells doors. Um, this is a little bit illogical, a little bit inconsistent, I should say. So if you go to a Shu Dian, a Shu Dian sells books, right? But a Mendian does not sell doors. <laughs> Mendian is like a branch. Xiang Ye. Oh, okay, so this is this. Mm, uh, it's a branch, a branch retail store. Okay. Um, so they sell something, but not doors. Mendian <laughs> Ji Champion. Mendian. Yeah, okay. So there's different outlets, I guess. So Mendian Tupian. In Shang. So usually you see that Mendian on signs and things like that. Mendian. Um, so you might see. Um, like in different areas of Beijing, it will say this is the Tongzhou Tongzhou Mendian, uh, Chaoyang Mendian, Haidian Mendian. <laughs> um, what if we put in Haidian? See what happens. Haidian. Haidian is a district of Beijing. Haidian. Yeah, Beijing Haidian Sanchi Chi Jia Tan Yin Mendian Bei Cha Chu. So maybe they got in trouble for something. Yeah. Is it in the picture? Uh, Mail Mendian, but Ban Tian Yao is kind of, it's Kao Yu, right? I think a fried, uh, fried fish you have in Beijing, a uh, roast fish in Beijing. Sai Bai Wei, Mendian. Yeah. So you have different Mendian, different branches of Sai Bai Wei. Mendian. Yeah, but you know, you kind of know this trap, this tri trick slash trap exists, right? Because a jiu dian doesn't necessarily sell alcohol, right? Jiu dian. Jiu dian. What do you call a liquor store? Actually, I don't know. Jiu lei zhuan mai dian. <laughs> Does it mean liquor store as well? Wine shop? Maybe it can also mean that. It's kind of a trap, isn't it? Maybe Mendian also means door store then, door shop. <laughs> yeah, the other one, Kanmen and Kanmen Ren. Kanmen Ren. So let's just look at some photos. Kanmen Ren. 
看门人，啊，多门这个多门看门人，啊 ，janitor watchman， so they're keeping an eye on the door， 嗯、um, ， so 看门啊看门人我看门，看门，看门狗 watch dogs， okay， 看门狗看 first turn， 嗯、um,。And there's also is it jiao jiao kan? I forget. I'm not sure. Let's get this right. Jiao kan. Kan kids. Can you kan kids? Is this first tone or? Oh, is it first tone or fourth tone? Yeah, I'm not so sure now. Just use jiao gu kids. You'll be fine. <laughs> I don't know the answer to that question, actually. All right, but there is a first tone can, and it's actually fairly common. Can Mandarin, or Bao An, you can say Bao An. Next is To. Um, yeah, To is used as a, in in quite a few ways, actually. Yi To Niu, a head of cattle, right? Um, to, this thing. To. Um, it also um, is used uh, um, as a kind of suffix, right? A directional suffix, like shang to. Ye to also means pertains to lead. Yeah. Um, like the one in front or the primary or best something. Mm. So we'll see how we go. To tiao. Yeah, Toutiao. It's actually the name of an app nowadays. Toutiao means headlines. Tou. Tou means head. Tiao means, uh, I guess, um, strip or line in the sense of a strip. Toutiao. Um, it's an app. Toutiao. Yeah, one of my friends work or used to work there at least. Toutiao. Yeah, this company. Um, in Beijing. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I used to work at Nankai, and so I ended up with all sorts of. Um, there was all sorts of students. I graduate and I get jobs at places like Fu <laughs> All right, and what's going on? My yeah, Fu There you go, Fu Um. Whoops. Fu Tiao. is headlines. Um, they just, it's what you think. It's in the news. So they name their company Headline. Yeah. Fair enough. Tou Pai. Front page. All right. Tou Pai. Tou meaning first. Uh, is Ling Tou the Tou, right? Um, this one. Ling Tou. Ming Tou Yang, Ming Tou, take the lead, be first. So, Tou Pai will be the first. Tou Pai. Tou Pai. The first sign, meaning the leading sign, is it? I don't know. Tou Pai. Tablet announcing the name of a leading actor or an theatrical theatrical production. The lead role, Tou Pai. Um, I say Tolpai. Uh, the textbook act doesn't say Tolpai. It says Tolban. Tolban. What is Tolban? Tolban. Candom. Front page. I guess it's. Nigga Chi Kanda. Nigga. Tolban. I mean, it looks like the front page of a newspaper. All right. I, uh, what's next? <laughs> I, I don't know. In China, newspapers are really becoming obsolete. Like, even if you go out of your way to find them, it can be a challenge. Um, okay, Tordong. I have only ever seen this word used in uh, one phrase, Tordong. Tordang, tang, tang meaning cabin. So Tordang, tang meaning first class cabin. Oh, okay, Tordang. I, I don't recall it seen elsewhere. Oh, actually, on the train as well. 
but it's the same concept, right? Trains, planes, boats, they have todongs. Todong tongue. Yeah, I think it's always first class. <laughs> Dong is dongji, right? Dongji. Dongji meaning grade. Todong. So top grade. There's no higher grade than this. All right. Toha. I don't know. I mean, I look at it to meaning first primary, this sort of thing. To ha. To ha. To ha. So player one is to ha. To ha wan jia. All right. So it's the person or the whatever's in first place. Not necessarily, <laughs> it's my top friend, my number one friend, maybe. Yeah, maybe it's like number one. Um, yeah, how do you, what, how do you explain the concept of number one in the sense of Star Trek in Chinese? Number one. Number one, Zai Xin Chu Mi Hang Zhong, Shi Ju Hang Dui Hang Zhang the Fu Shu. So they just use Yi Hang. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, Di Fu Guan. I don't know that word. Uh, A de Camp? A de Camp? Something like that. So we're not using to ha, we're just using yi ha. Yeah, all right. To ming, I think this is to ha de ming. <laughs> Di ge ming, to ming. Um, to ming. To ming. To ming. I don't, yeah. Don't recall encountering this. To ming. <laughs> Xia ba zui lian jia bi zi yan jing yan zhu tou fa wu tou mei ma yan yan jian yan jian is eyelids right why have they blocked out this one oh that's that's whoever made this er duo yi kong why would you get rid of this one <laughs> that's also lian jia right? is it zui chun um, all right, Tommy. So all I'm seeing is part names of the parts of your head. Um, so Tommy, first place, Tommy, shama shama. Tommy, then Oh, this is number one single. Okay, maybe like Taylor Swift or something like that. I don't know. Oh, the Beatles? Yeah. I'm pretty sure they had a few uh, number ones. Um, all right. Tom Ren. No, this is different. No, 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 blah, blah, blah. Um, Stephen Bang Toming. So this is like a ranking and who comes first. This is what, maybe this one will this. So these are the rankings and this is the to ming. Is there a zi ming? No, the mm, yin zi ming, that's different. Is there a ya ming? No. All right, I'm just guessing based on um, other words. Do you know the word ya jun? Yeah, Jun, Ji Jun. Yeah. I'm not sure. Have we studied those already? If we haven't studied them, you need to know them. Wan Jun, Ya Jun, Ji Jun. Champion, runner up, third place. Tou Tian. I've never encountered this. It says 
first previous day, Toitian. Oh, no, I haven't counted Toitian. Yeah, actually. So it means Qing Tian. This one, Toitian. The first day. Bi Toitian. Oh, okay. So the night before. Okay. Toitian. Toitian. Tong Toitian. Toitian. Wow, all right. It's not in the dictionary, is it? Tian. Yeah, it does not matter how long I've studied. I always find words like this, where it's like characters I learned like 20 years ago, maybe. Maybe 18, 19 years ago. 2005. Yeah, maybe I learned both those characters um, over 18 years ago and it's like here you go here's a new word <laughs> it still happens it's madness oh all right for you go yeah i've definitely encountered that for you go for you go for you go what does it mean So the first half hour, is it? The first hour. Yeah. So, yeah, it just means the first, right? Yeah. Can you say is that a thing? No, <laughs> that's not a thing. You need to put the E in there. All right. Oh, you good. Tong to. Yeah, usually it's tong to dao wei. I probably jotted that down there. No, I said tong to dao dao jiao. Um, tong to dao wei. From start to finish. Tong to from the head to the tail. Tong to dao wei. Tong to dao jiao from head to foot, head to toe. Tong to dao jiao. Um, yeah, tong to. Kai shi. Um, or maybe tong to zai zi kai shi. Come on, give me something to work with here. Oh, that's my Wi Fi. All right. Yeah, from the start. So maybe you want to restart. Start from the scratch again. Yeah, study from scratch again. Um, yeah, I've been known to do this. Um, things like, um, yeah, when I got the HSK6, I basically said one day, you know what? Starting from scratch again, learning all the words from, from zero, seeing if there's any gaps in my knowledge. And you're going to find there's a lot more gaps in your knowledge than you realize. <laughs> um, because when you're like at HSK1, you study these words to in such a kind of shallow depth that when you get to HSK6, it's like, whoa, okay, I need to fill in so many gaps here. <laughs> From start. Yeah. Next is I do not know what this means. Start. Start in the sense of initiate. To start, it is a verb. To start at first. Ah, oh, okay. Okay, so there's a few meanings here. Um, that's different. Ta tai chi to, that's to raise your head. Mostly it means look up. Tai chi to, kan kan. I'll put a yao in there or something like this. Didn't help. Otherwise, we're just going to get people raising their heads, and this is not especially useful. 
Oh yeah. Ang. This is also uh also means to raise Ang Chi Tho. That's an issue, isn't it? Um what am I gonna do? So every single one is Tai Chi Tho. Uh, how is used as a verb? Liru. Taman Jeding, Chito, Jumbei, Ming and the Shang Ye, Tihua. So start. So to begin preparations for the commercial plan of next year, next year's commercial plan. 开会之前，主持人起头介绍了今天的议程。So, so the meeting before the meeting starts, the host started introducing uh, today's agenda. I guess, yeah. 他起头向公司提出改善工作环境的建议。um, so she began. It's just Kaishi, right? And and what about when it's used as a synonym of Tihu? Do you know the there's a very common saying when she kai to nan when she kai to nan when she kaito nan here kaito means the start right not on the list what but when she kaito nan everything is difficult at the beginning yeah that's how it is you just make it easier and easier tito okay so uh jie xiang ji hua de tito a tito jie duan jie zai qu nian dong tian so the the initial stage of this plan is uh tuning last year winter we was at winter last year tamanda yo yi ti to yu da xue shi dai so began at this is a verb though mm, began ti to yu that's interesting you ben shu de ti to Okay, so this is the start of the book. Uh, oh, okay, so the book's like a non-fiction. Um, so the, the start of the book. Interesting. When shit kaitona, you must know that. I think it's very, very common. When shit. Angle. Sorry, I've got a bad angle here. That's my excuse. Kaito nan. When she kaito nan. Everything is hard to begin with. Okay. Um, and we'll do one. We'll do this word. Um, paito. Person at the head of a row. <laughs> uh, pai. Can mean a row, pay, yeah, the pay. Um, is this really a word? Pay tall. Uh, no, I, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to say this is not a word. <laughs> pay tall. I'm gonna have... Is this really a word? Like, I hope. At the head of a procession. Go gur, jan pai to. Pai gur, jan pai wei. So pai wei is the opposite. Pai to. Is this pai lie? Di yi pai lie? No. Pai lie. This is like rank first, right? Um, arrange in order. Uh, arrange 
first. Uh, it's not Pagliazzi. What am I thinking? Um, something like that. Nai zai di wei. There's something in that ballpark. Nai zai di wei. Or pai zai di. Pai ni di. Hmm. All right, pai tou. Well, yeah. To be honest, I'm fairly confident this is a useless word. <laughs> All right. What have I written here? Tou hao di ren. Oh, so that's your number one enemy. Okay, yeah, enemy number one. Uh, tou hao dami. What is tou hao dami? What it says? I don't know. It passed me, um, tou hao dami. It passed me, knew what she was thinking about, right? Um, tou hao liang shi. Oh, it just means it's like a name of a brand or something. Um, all right. So there's some rice that's called uh, Oha, the name of the brand. All right. Uh, what else is there with Tol? Um, there's multiple other words. We'll just quickly have a look while we're here. Woman Shun Bian Kan Yoshiman Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, wait hole. Wait hole literally means to like turn around and look. Wait hole. Um, but it usually is used metaphorically or figuratively in the sense of to reflect. Wait hole. Wait hole. Xiang xiang. This kind of thing. Wait hole can. Um, yeah, hui li xia tou. Um, yeah, bi yu. What's this? Wei gai. Repent and reform. Guo yi duan shi tian. Xiao dang yi huo. Oh yeah, hui tou jian. Yeah, there's that as well. <laughs> ma tou. Yeah. Um, ma tou. Meaning wharf. Yeah, I don't know why it's called that. <laughs> Lao tou. Yeah. Lao tou is like an old hat. This sort of thing. Someone who's, um, yeah, quite... Uh, oh, maybe it's not what I thought. Lao tou, meaning old, old bogey, maybe. I'm not sure about that one, actually. Jing tou. Uh, what is Jing Tou? Jing Tou is a lens slash scene, right? A lens in a camera, a lens that does things to light, like split it apart or focus, and a, a scene in a movie or um, a photo. Dian Tou, Dian here is a verb. Um, it's that. Dian Dian Tou. <laughs> Um, that's it, right? Nothing else? The end hole. Nod one's head. Give consent? Uh, okay. Tol now. Yeah, tol now. Like your brains. The now is brains. Tol now, your head brains. Made hole. This is made hole. <laughs> um, yeah, made hole. Jong to. Yeah, so Jong to, uh, that's another word of saying, another way of saying hour. Um, yeah, you go Jong to. You see it in novels, like different authors will use different phrasings. Depends where they're from, I think. Jong to is one example. Um, yeah, the other one I see similar to that is like, do you know Xiao De? Reminds me of this one, Xiao De. Some people say jidao, some people say xiao de. <laughs> right? Kind of depends on the person you're speaking to. Um, I think for the HSK, you should use jidao. <laughs> and so on. All right. There's plenty of others with Paul in them. I'd be there forever. Um, yeah. Can you say your whole mei wei? I don't know. I'm just going to pretend your toll may whatever. Yeah, I don't know. I just kind of made that up, but I feel like it's make upable. Your toll may way. 
It, there's a start but no end. <laughs> Yours whole melee. Yeah, um, but this one counts it as a chunk. I think, even though I just made it up, it's kind of Zuran Aranda Duma. You know this chunk? Zuran Aranda. Zuran Aranda. It just comes naturally. Zuran Aranda. Um, Zuran Aranda. Automatically. Zuran Aranda. Yeah. <laughs> There's a start and no end. Anyway, I don't want to your poor me way the Yishu Shachu Talun. Oh qua to jika hands it is the hui wa chita shao jing. Oh, woman should out jelly. Good day. Oh, woman should out jelly. See see that yeah. Uh, remember to like and subscribe and leave comments of your favorite word that contains to or whatever. We got through one page. <laughs> it takes me a while, but I feel like the second, the second book, the second edition, no, the second, oh, oh no, what's going on? Uh, the xia ce is, I don't know, tangibly harder than the first one. I think the first one for me nowadays is fairly straightforward. This one is posing more challenges for me, I think. All right, I will see you in the future. Bye bye.